Hello, Serge here from the Backyard Driving Range. I'm not going to the podium in the clipboard today because I'm going to talk about an experience I had in another golf lesson recently. And this one is going to basically be kind of about psychology and, and, and maybe uh, your attitude as to, as to your swing and, 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 and determining or deciding how, what the quality of that swing and that shot was, okay? I've seen this. I've seen this a number of times, and 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 it's it's starting to happen too often, and so uh, I think that's why I'm gonna, I'm bringing it to the nation today. I've I've I had a student, a very good student. He was like about a four to six handicap, and and had a pretty good grasp of the of the peak performance swing, and and uh, he came for a, a long session with me. Uh, new, uh, and we got him hitting the ball really good, and when he hit this one shot one time, and he just. Busted it. I felt it was. I felt it was. It sounded like a really good hit. The trajectory, the flight pattern was good. It was a good, good shot for the length for the club he was using. And in fact, in this case, I think it was a driver. And and so I'll tell you right now, he hit the ball way right of his target, right, which was his actual line, not his intended line. So I was trying to get into now about this thing about alignment and getting him to analyze that good shots to a wrong place don't necessarily mean it was a bad shot. It was a, could be a good swing, just bad alignment. So I asked him, I said, what'd you think of that swing? And so I was expecting him, and when I asked that question of people, of players aimed to the right, 99% of the time they're going <laughs> to come back and they're going to say, uh, I know going through their mind, they're saying, well, it was, felt like a pretty good swing. To, Contact was pretty good. The trajectory, the flight pattern was pretty good, but it's in the right bunker or it's in the right rough or the right edge of the woods or whatever. <coughs> I must have pushed it or blocked it. I was expecting that kind of answer from him. Instead, he came at me and said, I didn't like it. I said, really? What didn't you like about it? It wasn't solid. I said, really? It sounded pretty darn solid to me. He said, yeah, but it wasn't really solid. I said, so... What about, the, what about the trajectory, the flight pattern, the straightness of the shot, you know, and everything else? He said, that don't matter. It's just got to be solid. And I've heard that time and time again. I mean, I've seen three players hit pretty darn good golf shots. And in many cases, I knew it wasn't quite solid. But it was a pretty good shot, or as I like to call it, a really good miss. And they'd say, no, it wasn't any good. It wasn't solid. So the question I want to pose to all of you out there is yeah uh, maybe maybe I can I can do the Maya Cooper on this head it's my fault because I'm always saying hit the ball more solid straight longer sometimes I add that point in there shoot the lowest scores well so maybe I brought it on and I mean I hit the ball quite solid but I'm gonna tell you what I thin it a little bit I heal it a little bit I towed a little bit towards the toe and a little bit see what I'm saying a little I'm not saying a lot because if you start missing the sweet spot by a lot you're not really hitting good golf shots and and so but I'm all about good misses. Golf's a game of misses. He who misses best wins. Dr. Bob Rotella wrote a book called Golf is Not a Game of Perfect. Golf is like life. It's like business. Businesses can take little hits, but they can't take big hits. Big hits could put them in a bankruptcy or, or, or close the doors. And so same thing with golf. I tell folks right straight, you know, straight up, I'd rather and I'm going to use a somewhat derogatory term here, slap it around, skank it around, you know, just beat it around, keep it in play, and shoot, and shoot two, three, four under, then hit a dead solid perfect pure, and shoot 72. All right? Because it's all about getting, shooting your score. So golf is a game of misses. He who misses best wins. I believe Hogan used to make a statement something like that. And that's one of the biggest things I want to impress on you. I mean... I see golfers, I go out sometimes and I'm giving lessons and, and you know, students close to home, we go, and play, we go out and play a few holes now and then, and, and, and I see them get angry, I mean really angry, at shots they shouldn't be, They're not, and, I, and I've said it to some of them, I said, excuse me, you're not good enough to be angry enough about that shot, you should be over here tapping yourself on the shoulder, wow, what a good miss, normally that shot would have been in the left bunker or in the left woods, or I would have, I would have pulled it in the lake or something, or not pushed it out of bounds. And now it's inbounds and it's in play, and you got and, and you got a chance to just, you know, if it's a tee shot or something, hit it up on the green or close to the green and get it up and down. If you miss the green, it's in a good place where you can get it up and down. It's not some place where you got to chip back out or, or 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 whatever. The point is, is golf's a game of misses. He who misses best wins. And although we really love solid, solid is the ultimate. That's the penultimate thing of distance. Solid 
even with two or three miles an hour less club head speed, will go farther than, than the four or five more miles per hour speed miss hit a little bit. Okay? So solid is critical. It goes straighter, but when you're really close to that sweet spot, solid cannot be your definer, your solo definer. In fact, it shouldn't, it shouldn't be your definer of a golf shot. It should be, where is the shot relative to where I wanted it to go? Good misses are great. Stop beating yourself up. Good misses is what keeps you in the ball game. Tap yourself on the back. Look at that, man. I got this swing now, and my misses are right, pretty much just, just right of center, left of center. I'm in the ball game. When's the last time you took a penalty stroke or lost the ball? You start getting that much better. That's what it's all about. I've had people come up to me and hold the ball up, and they say, see this? And, uh, you know, whether, you know, whatever the ball's name is, I'd, I'd say it, but I know where they're going. And they did laugh, and I just say, this is the first time I've ever played golf where I didn't lose a golf ball. I started with this one on number one, and I finished with it on number 18. Golf's a game of misses. So let's, let's try to be good to ourselves now and then. Dr. Rotella once said that talk to yourself like you talk to your partner. If your partner hit a bad shot, the first thing you're saying to him is, okay, okay, all right, you're in play here. You can, you can still knock it up in the green, on the green, or if, you're, if you need a green, you can get it up and down, make the putt. You know, uh, you're still in the game. We can, you can do good. Hang in there. Keep grinding. We don't talk to ourselves that way most of the time. We just stand here and just, just take the knife and stab it through the heart. Or we stand here and we just, we just kind of dog, dog ourselves into the ground. Oh, you, you know, you fold like a cheap chair. Every time you, get, you need a shot, you just fold like a cheap chair. Talk to yourself good. But that starts, and I think you'll find you'll have a lot better self-talk when you start doing what? Accepting that good misses are what they are. A good miss gets up near the green, it gets on the green. Yeah, you might have pulled it a little bit, but if it's on the green, you got a 30-foot putt. That's better than being in the left or the right bunker or being short in the rough or long in the rough or whatever. Good misses is, a, is, is the ultimate way of playing golf because nobody hits them perfect all the time. Golf is not a game of perfect, so pat yourself on the back when you've got good misses and you're staying in the game. And now what that means is your recovery shots and your short game stuff is going to, and putting is going to get you. So... Start working on becoming a short game wizard, and that'll help. So how we think and how we talk to ourselves has a big role in, 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 in shooting those lower scores, which I usually end all these, all these dailies with. Go out there and shoot lower scores. Shoot lower scores by having good misses and talking nicely to yourself, all right, and having the proper attitude. So again, on playing psychology, I guess we'll call it. That's it for the search for today, and I'll be talking to you all again soon.